Welcome to the fifth and final video of Section 8 of Creating Reports with SQL Server 2012 Reporting Services. Upon completing this video, you will know how to create a dashboard out of existing reports using all of our previous techniques of subreports, charts, and drill down reports. Dashboards allow for online reporting of high level information to allow management to quickly find where the business is performing well and where attention needs to be placed. Let's start Create a Dashboard by adding a new item in the Solution Explorer. Select Report and name it Dashboard.RDL and then click on Add. Let's expand the size of the report body. Next, we will add four subreports by right clicking on the design surface and choosing Insert and then Subreport. We will resize the subreport object so all four will fit into our allotted space. Right click on the subreport object and select copy. Right click again and select paste. We will paste a total of three times so we will have four subreport objects on the palette. Now we need to assign a report to each of the subreport objects. On the top left, under subreport properties, we will assign the sparkline report to the subreport. We will also set the border to outline. In the top right subreport, under subreport properties, we will assign the gauge report and set the border to outline. In the bottom right report, under subreport properties, we will assign the indicator report and set the border to outline. In the bottom left subreport, we will assign the pie chart report and set the border to outline. After assigning the subreports and setting the border, we are ready to preview our dashboard report. Make sure to examine all subreport objects to ensure proper operation. Also, inspect printed versions of the dashboard to ensure proper alignment on the paper. We can always go back to the original reports and add descriptive labels to help the user understand what they are viewing, as we did in Video 4 of Section 7. In summary, dashboards allow for online reporting of high-level information. Decision makers should be able to determine what areas of their organization need attention just from a quick glance at the dashboard. The dashboard should be made from individual reports added as subreports to a parent report.